plus tarder, c'est encore une fois un honneur de présenter la personne grâce à qui nous sommes réunis et qui a rendu le succès de cet événement, M. Philippe de Gaspé-Beaubien, père, qui sera accompagné par son petit-fils Louis-Alexandre de Gaspé-Beaubien, un jeune homme de 16 ans, allumé comme ça se peut pas, dynamique, engagé, qui est l'initiateur de ce sommet et du concept Aqua Hacking à venir vous parler des visions de sa génération vis-à-vis -vis la préservation de l'eau. Veuillez accueillir des membres importants de la famille de Gaspé Vaubien. Mesdames, Messieurs, mon seul rôle ici, comme grand-père, c'est d'avoir le privilège de vous présenter mon petit-fils. Louis-Alexandre de Gaspé Beaubien, c'est grâce à toi que nous avons réussi à faire cette réunion et c'est avec plaisir et honneur que je te présente à cet auditoire. Bienvenue. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if I'd say all that about myself. Uh, I think I'm just a regular 16-year-old kid who has a who had an idea, um, my cousins, and had the, the means and resources to fulfill that idea. And I'm thankful every day for being given the opportunity to do that. So just thank you guys very much for everything. And uh, before I start, I'd like to say it is a great honor for me to be able to stand up here and be able to talk in front of you and represent the missing grandchildren of the family that aren't here right now. So thank you guys again for that. When my grandparents first came up to us and said, if you were given a means, in order to change the world, what would that be? And besides, um, we were given some suggestions, other ideas, but us as the grandchildren and the younger generation, we knew that it had to be water. Now, water is the founding element here on Earth. It is the building block of all life. Water is what shaped and molded this planet. Water is what feeds all living life forms. Water is what makes us as, as people. So simply put, water is, is energy. Water is the energy for all life that is required so that we can survive as a species and as a planet. Um, that is why we need to keep it clean and, and we need to make sure that it's pure for not just us, for not the older, younger generations, but for all generations and all species living on this planet. And so uh, we know that As a young generation, I can only do so much. I, I only have so much influence. That's why we need communities, we need First Nations, we need governments, businesses, politicians. We need everybody involved and, and backing this up. And that's why it was so amazing for me to be here yesterday and to be able to see that I, as someone of 16 years old, was making such a difference and that I had, we had gotten the environmental ministers of both Ontario and Quebec to attend this conference. So, Thank you again for that. That was, that was incredible to be able to experience. And so uh, we believed we must act because like I was saying, our, our, our ultimate goal is that together we can protect this river and make sure that we can all drink, swim, and fish, and also have fun inside and uh, around this river. So tomorrow starts today. We need to charge and repair what has been done so that tomorrow we can have a better life. It is totally unacceptable that we are drinking the same water in which raw sewage and pollution is being dumped. Is anyone accountable for this? Is anyone monitoring the health of our waterways, rivers and lakes? Je suis convaincu qu'il n'est jamais trop tôt pour faire une différence. Et dans le cas de l'eau, il faut faire vite. On est choyé par la vie, entouré d'un réseau des gens qui ont les mêmes, euh, qui ont les moyens de changer le cours des choses. Maintenant, c'est à nous, les jeunes, à prendre ce leadership. My brother, my cousin and I wanted to be involved in a project that focused on technology. We are a generation that believes that through social media, we can change the world. These tools give us the opportunity to mobilize and uh, express ourselves as never before. We are excited about the concept of hackathons. There are kind hackers and skilled hackers in this world that with their knowledge, we can make a huge difference. 
and preserving our rivers. I wish to thank all the hackers who are here today to help us with our cause. Thank you very much. Thank you for answering our call, and I want to tell you this is only the beginning, and that we will do everything possible to create a network and a community to help you, uh, of people all around the world. Our journey does not end here. There are several other major cities we'd like to go to, and hopefully next time we'll be able to go to Montreal, and uh, we're aiming to fix part of the part of the St. Lawrence in the area of Montreal. I hope that the hackers uh, continue to be committed to this initiative and continue to, to contribute. We invite governors and municipalities to make their data available for our hackers. We have identified over 148 issues on the Ottawa River and we need to solve them. We are moving towards a society more transparent and politicians must trust our hackers to process the data in a constructive manner. We must share our knowledge. This is the only way to have an integrated vision for all our waterways. I thank you for having answered the call to protect the Ottawa River. A special thank you to IBM, the Ottawa River Keeper, for their commitment and support in our case. I wish the hackers good luck in the competition, and ultimately, it is the Ottawa River who wins this. Thank you guys very much.